Hi. I'm Eric, an automotive technician with 15 years of experience. This video is going to explain the meaning of this error code, and show you how to diagnose and fix it. OBD2 fault code P0C80 means there is a circuit intermittent or erratic issue with the hybrid battery temperature sensor, G. This sensor is responsible for monitoring the temperature of the hybrid battery cells. When you encounter this OBD error, the vehicle typically exhibits the following symptoms. 1. Check engine light is on. 2. Hybrid system warning light is on. 3. Possible decrease in fuel economy. Now we talk about possible causes, and how to diagnose and fix. Wiring issue. Use a multimeter to check the wiring connections for the hybrid battery temperature sensor, G. Look for any loose, damaged, or corroded connections. Also, check for any exposed wiring that could be causing a short circuit. Repair or replace any damaged wiring connections. Clean any corroded connections and protect the wiring from exposure to prevent future issues. High Voltage Battery Interface Control Module Failure Use a scan tool to check for any fault codes related to the High Voltage Battery Interface Control Module. Also, inspect the module for any physical damage or signs of water intrusion. Replace the high voltage battery interface control module if fault codes are present or if physical damage slash water intrusion is found. Ensure that the new module is properly programmed to work with the vehicle's hybrid system. High voltage battery assembly failure. Perform a visual inspection of the high voltage battery assembly for any visible damage or leaks. Use a scan tool to check for any fault codes related to the high voltage battery assembly. Replace the high voltage battery assembly if any visible damage or leaks are found. Clear any fault codes and monitor the hybrid system for proper operation. If there are uncertainties, feel free to engage in discussions by leaving a comment. Alternatively, when facing difficulties, it is advisable to seek assistance from a professional auto repair shop and technicians. It is not recommended to handle it independently, especially when uncertain. Thanks for watching.